Ja, moin und damit herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Folge Game of Thrones Episode 1. Wir stehen jetzt kurz vor dem Thronsaal, äh, in dem wir uns scheinbar für irgendwas entschuldigen müssen. Lasst doch gerne ein Abo da und ein Like. Ich weiß, wir betteln sonst nicht so oft vor den Folgen, sondern meistens im Abspann. Ähm, aber ich kann trotzdem mal nett fragen, wenn es euch gefällt, wirklich einfach ein Abo da lassen. Ist ja auch for free quasi. Kostet nichts. Ist nur ein Klick. Und dann erfahrt ihr auch, wann es weitergeht. Like gerne auch da lassen. Und dann würde ich sagen, starten wir ins Spiel. Oh, guck mal, da steht Tyrion. Ach, einer meiner Lieblingscharaktere. Ist, by the way, Fun Fact, auch der, Lieb äh, der Lieblingscharakter von you George R. R. Martin, der Autor von Game of Thrones. Deswegen äh, überlebt Tyrion ja auch so viel. Oh, und Cersei hat ja auch noch lange Haare. Approach the throne. Kann ich mich irgendwie anders bewegen? Ne, ich kann nur stehen bleiben oder weitergehen. Tuschel, 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 tuschel. Ach, die Leute hier sind wieder alle so herzensgut. Ah, Lady Marjorie. Aren't you looking lovely this evening? Lord Tyrion. Your Grace? With your Euer permission, Gnaden. allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Ach, komm, wir knien mal. Your Grace. The girl knows her courtesies. Impressive. You may rise. Wir wollen ja nicht sterben. House Forrester is a northern house loyal to the king. Are they? I beg your pardon, Your Grace. I wasn't talking to you. I want to hear from the girl. Ja, natürlich. Wir is sind your immer family loyal to the king? Ist immer loyal. Perhaps you should ask the new Lord Forrester. He's not here, is he? She is. Yes, Your Grace. To the one true king. The one true king. Yet she didn't say which. The girl is clever. <laughs> she only meant... I don't care what she meant. I care what she said. I won't stand for impertinence from a girl of the North. If you would give her the chance to explain... Perhaps she can explain why the Foresters have been loyal bannermen to House Stark for centuries. A house of traitors. Ah, I agree, Your Grace. Your Grace. Oh, we're okay. really Arschkriecher, ey. The Starks were your liege lord, yet you name them traitors so easily. Is it any wonder you were so oh, impertinent man. to ask which king deserves your loyalty, if you have any loyalty at all? Is your house willing to swear fealty to your new liege lord, Roos Bolton? Naturally. Yes, your grace. Absolutely. I see. Despite the fact Roos Bolton allied with Walder Frey, if it was me, I'd find it difficult to so quickly forgive the men who killed my father. Old allegiances are not easily abandoned, but now that the war is over, we must look to rebuild and forge new alliances. There are ships and shields to be built, and Joffrey will need a steady supply of ironwood for his armies. I'm told there are others who would happily serve that purpose. But I trust we can rely on House Forrester. Klar. Forrester Ironwood does seem rather unique. Yes, Natürlich. Gerne. It would be a shame to ah, see the so hands of another house. Blöde Kuh, ey. I imagine you do almost so anything to prevent that from happening, wouldn't you? Ask any Lannister, and they do whatever was necessary to save Casterly Rock. It would be unfortunate to see another house lay claim to what's yours. Yes, so, ja, yes, anything, bla 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 hier. Man muss ja aber auch sagen, sie I sieht see. echt gut aus, Cersei. What aber nur mit den Lampen. Do, Cersei? It's not as if she fought beside the Starks, wielding a battle axe for the Northern Army. Ja, so ist es. Ich bin nur ein kleines armes Mädel. Can we truly blame those who end up on the wrong side of the war? Our dear Marjorie here was betrothed to Renly Baratheon on the false assumption that he would one day rule the Seven Kingdoms. Can we fault her for her mistake? Should she be held accountable? Ich 
bin sicher, sie bereut sure es. Perhaps, perhaps not. If there's a point to this, I hope you find it quickly. <lacht> Loyalty can be such a hard thing to define. This city alone is filled with all sorts of ambitious opportunists looking to reinvent themselves, pretending to be something they're not. Who knows what lurks within their hearts? You are a girl from the north here in service to Lady Marjorie. One can only assume her interests are yours. Yet loyalty to a king that must be absolute beyond question. Ja, ohne jede Frage. Klar. Und wenn deine Loyalität become conflicted between your king and the very person whom you serve, what would you do then? Oh I'm Gott, sure sie fragt mich was. Go on. Ich sag gar nichts. Fuck. Evading the question won't help her cause. Who do you choose? Ich finde die besser als Joffrey. Your Grace. Clearly your handmaiden does not have her priority straight. Little cool. She is a threat to the crown, isn't she? The most dangerous handmaiden in all of King's Landing. <lacht> My sense is this girl will say almost anything to get what she wants. Which is not very encouraging. Ich habe auch nicht gedacht, dass ich Joffrey diene. I'd like a word with you, if I may. Of course, your grace. Ja, oh, die ist böse auf uns. Dabei waren wir doch nur loyal ihr gegenüber. I'll walk you out. Oh, das ist aber nett. This may come as a surprise, but I met your father once at the tourney at Lannisport. Even then, he didn't trust Ruse Bolton. We only spoke briefly, but your father struck me as an honorable man. You have my condolences for his loss. These would be trying times for your family. Even the best Lord of Tyrion. Thank you, Lord Tyrion. That's very kind of you to say. You were brave to declare your loyalty to Lady Marjorie. No doubt she was pleased, but Cersei, she will not soon forget what you said. Sheet. It was quite the first impression. I, of course, found it all highly entertaining. But it certainly wasn't what Cersei was expecting. I wasn't trying to please her. I think that was clear to everyone. My sister and I have our differences. She takes great pleasure in her little charades. I take mine in thwarting them. We must find our amusements where we can. She threatened to give your ironwood to another house. It is the master of coin who decides such matters. The crown needs boats. Oh, boats man. need wood. And I speak for the crown in this regard. Not her. You can help my family. Yeah, ja, eben. Hilf uns. I suppose the crown could be persuaded to secure ironwood from House Forrester. Lady Marjorie might not look favorably on such an alliance. And it would infuriate Cersei. <laughs> Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Are you willing to risk that? Yeah, ja, hauptsache wir können's behalten. Here yes, I am. To take Lotarian. Please. You are a brave girl, aren't you? I'll consider it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I promised Sansa I would join her for dinner tonight. Oh, Sansa. Three beautiful bottles of Dornish wine await my arrival. The mere thought of them makes me thirsty already. Oh, I hope we meet again. Mm. Nothing would make Cersei happier. Until then, be careful. This is not the move. <coughs> King's Landing can be Sorry. a nest of vipers to the uninitiated. A nest of schlang. Ja, das ist wahr. Oh, wir bleiben in Königsmund. Mira, I was worried. Nein, ich schlebe noch. Cersei has a way of looking at you, so you're nothing. It's more than a little intimidating. Mm, not so. It didn't go very well. I'm sorry. Cersei is known for being rather difficult. But at least it's over now. Lady Hopefully. Marjorie has spent the entire day working on seating arrangements for the wedding. 
Of course, you and I are seated way at the back, here with the fourth cousins and the ninth born sons. Ah, Sir Jamie. I wouldn't mind tarnishing that white cloak of his. Sarah, <laughs> what? <laughs> it's true. And Oberyn Martell, the Red Viper. Oh, we yeah. are. I'm told he has a paramour. Which I doubt is Dawn's wife. Das so spassig, you will get, get us in trouble. Oh, We're just gesagt. having some fun. Perhaps Lady Marjorie could make the right introductions. Who knows? We might need to have future husbands. Although, marrying a king, I can only imagine what that would be like. Hmm. Would you marry Joffrey if it meant you'd become queen? Nine. He does have a certain look about him, and he's always treated Lady Marjorie well. Nicht, nicht I'd Joffrey. be willing to marry, but not Joffrey. Well, I would marry him. Imagine the power you would have as Queen of the Seven Kingdoms. I might even allow you to be my handmaiden. Toll. Let's see, who else should we marry off? Brienne of Tarth and Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> What a perfect match. Riese und Zwerg. Ja, ja. Sir Bronn and... What are you doing? Well... Sarah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my lady. As am I. We shouldn't have been messing about. This is not a game. It's a battle plan. Allies and enemies can be made with every move. Yet they say it is men who are powerful. The Queen was rather disappointed by your display, Mira. I'm just glad it's over. No. Yeah. King's Landing can be exhausting sometimes. There's always someone to please or some perceived slight to smooth over. I fear it will only get worse when I am queen. Once they know your true heart, the lords and ladies will have no choice but to love you. Do you agree? Yeah, naturally, Sarah is right. Once Ihr habt zwar gerade nicht zugehört, aber es wird bestimmt richtig sein. You okay. learn very ich hab geguckt, was auf dem Tisch steht. <lacht> you were brave agreeing to obey the Boltons. That cannot have been easy. I know you must fear what Lord Bolton might do to your family. I do appreciate your willingness to appease her, as difficult as it may have been. Hm. Thank you, my Mann, lady. Mann, Mann, das ist echt schwierig hier. There's been something on my mind. Something important. Ask for her help. Ich frag sie. I, I did have a favor to ask of you in return. Whatever you wish to say, you can say it in front of Sarah. There are no secrets between us. Okay. It's about my family. I trust her. Okay, dann bleibt Sarah. Go on. Mm, could Geoffrey help? Ask. Please, Ramsay Snow is on his way to Ironrath to see my brother bend the knee. Ramsay? Roos Bolton's bastard. I fear my family will suffer if Ramsay is left to do as he likes. But if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown. Peter. That is no small request. Especially now. Aber du bist bei Königin. Knows only too well your family fought for the Starks. And now you would have me ask him to intervene. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. King Joffrey won't like it. Just think how he turned on Lady Sansa. Es ist der it dire. is that dire, my lady. So I fear for my family's safety. Oh, I don't know, know Hunde blick drauf. If Cersei were to find out. <sighs> you are adored by don't the king. The queen bully you. you have power over him, Lady Marjorie, as no one else does. Not even his mother. 
Ramsay Snow will arrive at Iron Ramsay. Bei Lannistern weiß man nie. I would never ask this if you if it weren't so urgent. Very well. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise anything. Thank you, my lady. Ach, I will send a raven to my family at once. Sehr nett. Jetzt wird Sarah wahrscheinlich hier noch sagen. Auf wird sie nicht. Okay, dann würde ich sagen, heute mal eine kürzere Folge. Aber bevor wir gleich äh, schauen, was unser Knappe auf dem Weg zur Mauer macht, würde ich sagen, herzlichen Dank fürs Zuschauen. Bis dahin. Tschö. Mit Ö.